It's vulnerable in our city is our homeless residents. KLBK's Brenda Lipinski spoke to the director of Open Door and one of the residents to see what they're doing to protect themselves from the virus. Willie Price has been going to Open Door for the past four months. He's recently heard about the coronavirus. We go to different places like the library, we go to different churches to eat, so we're more in contact with more people that may be sick than may be in contact with it already. Because of that, he says he's taking all precautions. I don't shake hands with people. I'd rather give them a fist bump instead of shaking hands. I don't do hugs anymore. Executive Director of Open Door Chad Wheeler says the homeless population faces different challenges with the coronavirus. Well, you know, we're being told everywhere to uh, limit contact with uh, social distancing, you know, see what we can do to stay home. Uh, but the problem with people in homelessness is you tell that people stay home and they're all together in a shelter or wherever they are, you know, they don't have the ability to isolate like the rest of the population. Homeless people are uh, people that have high risk for infection to begin with. You know, we have compromised immune systems, a lot of elderly people in homelessness. Wheeler says they're following CDC recommendations and urging their residents to stay safe. We're just really encouraging people, wash your hands. Um, if you're sick, stay in one part of the building. Um, if you are, you know, your normal routine is to eat and chat it up with people around the table, just give yourself some more distance. He says they can't foresee the future, but they're making plans to keep the homeless and other Lubbock residents safe. We are, you know, in conversation with uh, the City of Lubbock Health Department and other homeless service providers in town. Brenda Lipinski, KLBK News.